I'm taking a trip to Nairobi. Today I'm going to travel to Jinja and then tomorrow I'm going to travel from Jinja to Nairobi by bus. So I'll take you on that journey as well but today on this trip I'm going to travel to Jinja and over the course of this journey I'm going to show you some of the clips from my time in uh, Kampala, in Uganda, some of my most enjoyable experiences here. I've been vlogging in Uganda since January 2022. It's now June 2022, June the 7th. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. Hopefully you can see after this video why I've had such an amazing time here and why I love Uganda so much. And then I'll, uh, I'll show you a bit of the trip to Jinja as well. You just came. I didn't respond to you. Oh, okay, sorry. All right. All right, guys, so the first video I'm going to show you is a boat trip that I took when I first arrived here. I just got to Kampala on the 12th of January, and I think the next day I just decided to go film on a boat trip. So, yeah, I went down to the, down to the lake, met some guys down there, and they took me on a boat. I don't know, where is there to go? Okay, uh, what you, want to, you can come through. I'll come in? Okay. <coughs> right. So I think it's going to take you around here. Take me around there, okay. And then maybe. Yeah. Is there somewhere that's good to go? Somewhere good to go. Yeah. Is there somewhere that people usually go on the boats? Yeah, but it's quite far. Like. Too far? Not very far. Uh, like would someone need like, too far. an engine. Oh yeah. Oh, they need an engine? Yeah. yeah. Permit. <laughs> okay, allow me to be your, how do they say, assistant cameraman? <laughs> yeah, so you have to be Bahamian. Are we good to go, brother? <laughs> nice. Oh, God, look at this. I'm just going to go across there. This way. Come on, Papa. Drop it. Do we go here and then go off that way? <laughs> Yeah? I'm making a little YouTube video. Oh, interesting. Yeah? What's this? Uh, it's where you hey, I'm Phil. I'm Yako. Yako? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice. To meet you. I, nice. My, my I want to bring my MacBook here and just, just chill I, out. I brought uh, to, to cheer me up here. It's nice. This is a great setup. <laughs> what are you guys' names? Danny. Jan. 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 Yeah. Nice to meet you, Danny and Jan. You all right? Nice boat. So what's your YouTube about? Well, I don't really know yet. I'm just taking videos and... <laughs> <laughs> he looks very professional, like, yeah. Yeah, well, it makes people actually think that you're doing... If I was just holding the phone, then they'd be like, are you just taking a video of me? <laughs> <laughs> but now I'm like, I've got a stick. Yeah, yeah. So... It makes, it makes, it makes, it feel, it makes it feel like being like, okay, okay. <laughs> Moses, why do you love Uganda? Do you love Uganda? Of course. Yeah? Uganda is a good country. Uh, we really, really enjoy it. And uh, what I could say that you who are there, you're really missing. You're missing a lot. Yeah. May you also get time. You come, you happen to come and visit. You gotta you come have here. a story to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next video I'm gonna show you is me going down to buy some fish. And I was having a laugh with them when I first arrived here. I think it was the day after I went on the boat trip. How many hours will I be sitting here waiting for the fish? Ascari is there. One hour. One and a half hours. Oh, it's too long. It's too long. <laughs> I want to go and exercise. Uh, you exercise. Don't say it's too long. Yeah. You have to do it exercise, then you can be strong. Yeah, I know. Like me. You strong? Yeah. <laughs> What's your name? Margaret. Margaret. Nice to meet you, Margaret. Say hello to YouTube. Uh, <laughs> like to see you also. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Margaret, you're going to be famous. You're going to be famous on the internet. Hey. <laughs> Margaret is very strong. I'm very strong. <laughs> uh -huh, and she doesn't have this weak pink skin like me. I, I don't have a weak. That's why you see them, they look at <laughs> <the> <laughs>
Oh, they need the Africans to work because they can't they can't do the work themselves. Because they're weak. Wow. How many days do you work there? Days in a week, I work six days. Six days. Is yeah, today a day off? My off day is on Tuesday. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. But the payment they're giving us is very, bad. very little money. Very, very little. Like uh, someone, like me, have responsibility. I have got four children. Four children? Yes. Wow. One is in senior two. Then the second is in P6. The third one is in P2. Then the fourth I've just joined. Oh, yeah? Sorry. Congratulations. So, That's a lot. But and they're giving us just 250. So with this place. 250. 200 per month. Per month. So in dollars, that is less than one hundred dollars. Not even one hundred dollars. Yeah. Yes, yeah, sixty, like sixty dollars. Sixty or sixty something there. Mm. Mm. That's what they're using. Now. So now we have to put rent in that. Yeah. And how much yeah. does rent? Rent I'm paying one hundred and twenty. One hundred twenty thousand. The remaining is one hundred and thirty. Yes. Now one hundred and thirty. Only that with this bicycle of mine. Sometimes, like when you have a luggage. Yes. Or maybe cement. If you have a cement, you want me to take the flight, I can carry, I take, yeah. I get that one little, also I squeeze a little bit. But if to wait, just only that money, can't do anything. Yeah. <laughs> Margaret, Margaret, she's <laughs> very clever. <laughs> she's, she's very, very persistent. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Moses, so, see you. Oh, yeah, take my WhatsApp, WhatsApp. yeah. Near the taxi park so I love that video because it really it really let me know that the Ugand Ugandan people when I arrived here are so friendly even people that had so little I mean one of the guys there told me he made $71 per month and still he was nice and kind and funny and everything so it was amazing Anyway, I'm trying to find the bus to Jinja. The next video is when I decided that I was going to go and visit Makerere University, beautiful university in Kampala, um, but I got stopped by the police. Hello. Hello. You okay? Oh, Uganda police. Oh, you mean me with the phone? Business? Huh? Business? Which business? Yes. Me? What kind of business? I'm Isaac. I'm Isaac. I'm saying what is the business you're conducting? I'm, a, no business. I'm a visitor walking and I was walking around walking to around. visit the university uh, and these guys were telling me all about the beautiful campus and, uh, and how it's a great place to study. Uh, so. so you're a student? Yeah, I'm a student. But only we take it okay. late for students. Mm. Okay. We take it late when students are using their Well, I'm I'm just going to I'm just going to leave. So most of foreigners, I told you foreigners, mm. and I uh, said we are in a terror threat. Yes. Okay. You understand this? Yes, yes. So if the university is uh, in a foreigner within and doing his business, taking videos, what uh, what mm. is the what a threat? Mm. You are getting it. Ah. Mm. Eh? And yeah, yet, no one the business is what we are doing. Like no one is, yeah. no, yeah. there is no one who is aware that you are inside. Mm. Okay. You get me? Mm. Yeah? So you want me to leave? So let's move to the station. But no, but, but please, I want to. You got access from the main I, entrance. Yeah, so I go out it the main is. entrance. It I don't know. I don't want to go to the police station. I didn't realize I was doing something wrong. I yeah. don't mind that, but since he passed through main. Because I actually came in through me, uh -huh. I was asking for direction. Eh? Uh -huh. So, listen, the mm. rest I will interrogate him at the station. Mm. Don't mind. Don't mind. We want to get if they are genuine person or what. Oh, I understand. You are getting genuine. Yeah? Yes, so, let's move to the station. Yeah, so, I don't know. They took me to the office and they. <laughs> I'm not going to say what happened, but I think everybody knows. Anyway, that was a nice baptism of arrival in uh, in Uganda. I guess it was a heightened environment after uh, after lockdown and some of the terrorist attacks. So, yeah, the next video is uh, of me in Kalangala Island. 
I went touring around the island, they've got the palm industry, uh, I went to visit a shrine, so yeah, and this really nice guy took me around. Oh, okay, let's ride. There's no fish where we went, so we're gonna try somewhere else, I think, yeah? yeah. Okay, see you. Two men hunting for fish. <laughs> <laughs> where are the fish? <laughs> so, you went around with two eggs or three or four eggs? Three. Three eggs and, and two. Chapati or one? What are you gonna have? <laughs> When you get to, you'll be satisfied. I'll have two, but I'll be, but be more satisfied than one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, but uh, maybe once I, I'll have one, and then I can uh, decide. Honestly, guys, I don't, I don't want to eat two chapatis. <laughs> okay. I would love to. I know you came to work, but okay. I'm not no, that hungry. We are just joking. Thank you so much. Got some popcorn for the trip. <laughs> Mm. All right, that's us leaving Taxi Park. Next video I'm going to show you guys is from my trip to Busawoko Falls um, when I went to Jinja back in March. So we had fun doing water massage and uh, just hanging out with some of the guys down there. So. Uganda! <laughs> Oh yeah? Oh yeah yeah yeah. You wanna you wanna take it for me? Yeah, you stand here. Okay. Cool. Okay. I'm making videos for my trip. You mind if I'm filming? Oh, I sit here? Okay, okay, okay. Right, I'm gonna play this game. This one? Okay. Sorry, <laughs> Guys, I hope you enjoy, enjoyed the Busawoko Falls. Next video is with Mama Uganda. She has like 40 kids and we went to visit her and took her some food and stuff like that. So yeah, we've actually just stopped. Is she, is she going to give us more children or she has now stopped? Ah. <laughs> Now she has said that she will not stop delivering as long as she gets a man that can understand. She will continue wow. producing. Me? <laughs> you want a new dad? Yeah. I'm so good dad. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of responsibility. Now the children have accepted you to be your dad. Thank you so much. <laughs>
So there sleeps young children. Young, so here the, the young girls and boys sleep. Yes. Yeah. Let's see. How many beds? Four beds. One, two. So how many children sleep? <laughs> So they sleep three, three. Three, three in each of the beds. So uh, six, twelve, twelve in this room. And it's the smaller children. And is it uh, boys and girls? Yeah, they mix them. With the younger ones? Yeah. I see. After you. Yeah. Alright guys, that's us left the food stop. Now we're... Uh, Continuing on to Kabira Forest. So anyway, the next video I'm going to show you is from Nakasero Market, where we tasted some pineapples. The one for two thousand. Yeah, okay. the good one. Eh? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yours. Oh, you have the mango as well. Okay, we'll come another day. Today we do pineapple. Tomorrow we do mango. Ugandan pine nut are the best in East Africa. Oh yeah? Yeah. 2000, yeah? Yeah. So obviously now we peel. Yeah. So you peel like this and then you take the top off. Then you cut into pieces. As you see. We are going to eat from here. We are going to taste it. Like that? Yes. Okay. Okay. So this is the way to do the pineapple in, uh, in the mall, in the, in the market. Juicy pineapple. This pineapple. Man, I've used it. The best, the best, the best I've ever tasted. Oh. Oh my god. It's very delicious. Is there any fish? Yeah? Oh, nice one. <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Nice to see you, nice to see you. Alright, we're all in line for our food now. It's lunch time. Have you all washed your hands? Yes. <laughs> What is this? G nuts. Yeah. Ah, and pumpkin yes. and beans, potato, fish. What kind of fish? What kind of fish? Is it tilapia? And then what is this one? Millet. Millet. Ah. Okay. Wow. Some local food. Oh, some matuki. Yeah. Yeah. I can't eat it anymore. I'm too full. Mm. Oh, but I can have space for this. So this cream looked like it was going to be sweet, but it's not sweet. It's cow ghee. That's what it's made from, cow ghee. It's too, too sour, too bitter for me. I'm not having it. <laughs> Wow, so how long have you guys been preparing everything to you all day? You can reserve this like, um, and then we... Hours? For, oh. for today, for this? For today, it's oh, supposed to yeah, be like this. We woke up at about 4 a.m. 4 a.m.? Yeah. 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 Oh. So it's pretty early, but we're excited. Yes. And we this can't wait. Nice. Wow, you guys look so beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank oh. you.
So in this video I'm gonna show you Kololo. Uh, we're gonna do a tour around Kololo and uh, check out Meza restaurant. Hello. He's deaf. And I don't do I don't do sign language, but we're good friends. Good to see you. <laughs> Okay, what have we got here? We've got a little mango juice. mango juice. I got the falafel wrap. Yes. And then I got this thing called the Blue Lagoon, and it's probably the most tasty juice I've had since I've been here. And then I got a little, another little double espresso because I'm a coffee addict. And Huns is going to have the chicken shawarma because people from Uganda love like chicken. chicken yeah. So they're going to bring it over. <laughs> so here's the chicken. Chicken, chicken sandwich. Should I, should I open it? Yeah, open it up. <laughs> Let the people see what they can have. Where's the chicken here? Right. There it is. Do you like spicy food? Yes, of course. This is this sauce is very spicy and tasty. Right, let's see it. <laughs> Good? Yeah, it's nice. nice. <laughs> Alright guys, and here's mine, the falafel wrap. Look at it. Big beautiful sandwich. Nom, nom, nom. Nom, 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 Wow. Ami, you shouldn't have done that. Ami kindly got us uh, lunch, so everybody, they like shawarma, which is basically everyone in Uganda. Number one. The number one. <laughs> the number one is... <laughs> Come in and say hi to these guys. Ciao. We're going to go and check out Achasha Mall now. Thank you. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Are you coming off too? Okay. Oh, thank you so much. There you go. You're welcome. This video, I'm going to check out Millennium Hotel and uh, go to an event in uh, Alliance Francaise organized by Talent Africa. What? This is probably one of the best views I've ever seen in, uh, in Uganda of the city. Have you been to uh, Latitude Hotel yet? Oh, it's amazing. So nice. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful place. That sky though, look. All right. What's your name? Alice. Hi, Alice. Say hi to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Tell them to subscribe to my channel. You're not doing a very good job of telling people to subscribe, are you? Yeah, go for it. Tell tell everybody to yeah subscribe to his channel. Hi guys, can we subscribe to his channel? Yeah, that's what I'm asking you. Okay, you want to channel about? Okay, fine. I'll tell you what it's about. It's about culture. It's about events. I did a blankets and wine video. Did, did you hear about blankets and wine? I've seen my channel. You've seen my channel? Wait, wait, wait. That's me. <laughs> oh. I've seen your YouTube channel. You're talking about the blankets and wine in Uganda. And, and what else? Uh, yes, you know white shirt? I was, I've not worn a white shirt before. Show me on your phone. Is that banned as well? Uh, so Alice has actually seen my, uh, my blankets and wine video. There she is. Did you enjoy it? Mm -hmm. should, people, okay. should people subscribe to my channel? I will. Cheers, bro. Cheers, bro. Simon is very nicely going to be going and having food with his beautiful girlfriend. So I'm going to be going into the event just now. I will enjoy uh, I will come for a little bit. You're going to come in? Oh, yeah. a little bit, yeah. Nice, nice. That sunset, how did you enjoy the sunset? Nice. Sunset was nice. Yeah, it was a beautiful lovely. like um, rooftop bar. It was nice. Yeah, you guys yeah, should check it out. If anyone comes to Camp Hala, come and check out Millennium Terrace. It's a good place to go. One thing I love about Uganda, we have different cultures, different languages, different people living in the same country as one. Without segregating, we work together. We work with the Westerners, the Northerners, the Central. Like, how oh, I love Uganda. It is unity, diversity. Wow. 
We don't want. Pantorang and Bagamati. Where I got now, I see the need. I have you. In this video, I take a walk around Mienga. It's one of the nice areas in Kampala. We're just about to cross the bridge actually into Jinja, so I'm gonna cross the Nile soon. But yeah, check out this video, it's cool. Yeah, I think I should bring my boyfriend for a spot date here. I don't think you had a boyfriend. I do. One minute she's got a boyfriend, the next minute she doesn't yeah, have a boyfriend. Yeah, because he's so toxic, guys. <laughs> so to toxic. You're actually gonna say yeah, this? Yeah, yeah, he's so toxic. Oh. And I know you're watching this, you're so toxic, but oh. I love you. Oh wow, I'm gonna have to bleep out there. <laughs> the F words but all right well this is your opportunity to get back at your uh, oh, talented wow. boyfriend oh, wow. really nice. but she's just having such a great time hanging out with me I am oh. having such a great time <laughs> he's gonna murder me right let's go Maya's going to leave me she's and going, I'm going to, to church guys she's going to church so yeah. thank you for coming on the tour with me you're even though it was your idea and now I'm continuing yeah you're welcome so let him take you around guys let me show you more places about Mienga. Oh. It's an amazing place. So next stop, we're going to go back into the drop. The drop is a social hub where you can work, eat and connect with people from all over the country and outside the country. Yeah, we have a beautiful co-working space upstairs. And every time I mention it, everyone's like, oh, I go there on Fridays for the karaoke. So we're known for the karaoke. Uh, yeah, you're also, you're very. <laughs> oh, you should come through for the karaoke. You will be very entertained and you won't want to miss any karaoke. I even sang on Friday night. Do you know what? I might even put like oh, a yeah, tiny. Oh you really were good. <laughs> no, I wasn't. I heard you on the mic. Everyone was running. It's like, oh yeah, it's Phil, it's Phil. But anyway, I'm going to put a little clip yeah. of me singing. Probably just the best note. He's really good. Oh, thank you so much. So you guys did so that. Please come through every Friday for karaoke. You yeah. will have an amazing time. This next video is from the Fireboy concert, which was lit. Hey, how are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you message me on Instagram? Yeah, 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 yeah. You were the hype man. Yeah. I did, I did tonight as well. See you too. Yeah. What you did, break in the machine. Oh, man. <laughs> I can't do my legs together, man. I'm always just going to do this. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. This one. Thank you. One more. It's a good one. Yeah, when I got to Uganda, I also met these guys from that have an app called Tubayo and they organize a market day every month. So this next clip is from Market Day where we were just having fun. Hey. You know what to say? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know you. I'm, I'm dancing and she's like, okay. No, you look so attractive. So I had to, you know, defend myself and say, okay. Oh. <laughs> I think we should take this off camera. <laughs> Try here. This is your moment to do something funny in between me speaking to all the souls, so uh, be funny. <laughs> you can't put me on a spot like that, man. Because we can't go from stall to stall, it's boring, so now you're tired. Keep good. it active. Yeah, okay, okay. Careful, active. Yeah, so why, why are you wearing this? Because you're representing. Representing two by You've got a lot of stain on your t shirt. Yeah, man. Well, you know, Phil. Okay. Anyway. Back to the sauce. Uh, I have a lot of things I can say, but I need you to get that monetization money. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not gonna say. Oh, hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I feel like I'm like this guy that just goes around and 
You are that guy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm that it's guy. It's getting annoying. <laughs> it's getting annoying. Are you with this person? Oh, do you actually? Yeah. I know exactly. What is this? It's a uh, multiple boost. Oh, I see, I see. Very amazing. So for me, it smells so nice. Can, Can I give it home the other time? Yeah. When you record it and it smells. Can I give it a sniff? Yes. Can please. you tell me? Yes, yes, of course. Sniffing the. He's he's a he's a professional I sniffer. Know. Wait, uh, is, no, yeah. this isn't open. To... I don't trained him at the canine. No, no. Uh, okay, fine. Okay. Well, he can sniff right. something else. I'll, I'll come right to your house and sniff it later. You can sniff. I'll come right to your house and sniff your your bathroom. Okay, I'm gonna sniff. Wait, hold on. I'll sniff. I'll sniff this. We don't want to open the big bottle, but. What do you give it? It smells so. What do I give it? Out of ten. Stop trying to rate things. <laughs> Last time I asked him, you went on a date, how much did you give it out of 10? I went on a date, he was like, how do we do? I said, we don't rate uh, girls in the in 2022, actually, Tahir. My friends Mago and Harriet also work in education in Uganda. So one day we decided to take some kids who had never been to a restaurant before to Middle East restaurant because the owner, Mohammed, kindly offered to, to feed them. So we took them up there. Right. Uh -huh. Mohammed's annoyed at me for turning up and only serving the kids small food. He wanted to give them too much more. You stop, stop. How do you do that? <laughs> Drinks no problem. Let me organize for the first. Okay. Just like this. Okay, Dave. Thanks. Look at this one. Hey guys. Hi. How are you? You're almost welcome. Oh. See, bring them here to bring them to. Wait, they just. <laughs> so this is this is Mohammed. He owns the restaurant. He's kindly offered you the food today. Did you say thank you? After he's going to give you more until your bellies are like this. Maybe so do you know what? Yeah, yeah. So Mago. Yeah. Hello, Mohammed. Thank you so so much. Thank you for the work. It's not easy, but yeah. me, but me, I love such things. Yeah. Because I came from like a ghetto area. Yeah. Oh. Yes. So one day we'll invite you and you can see what they call it. We've never been to a hotel like this ever since we were born. <laughs> I want to, to you want to, to see? Yes. Not to me. I want them to, to feel full, yes. full. Okay. This one really. We didn't know. They said order from the kids. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you so much. Who told no, you? nobody said no. But from the menu. the menu. We just looked at the kids' menus. Yes. <laughs> and this video is from the Galaxy TV event where. I basically became paparazzi chasing around all the Ugandan musicians. It was a hilarious day. A lot of fun going to all these different types of events while I was there. just stopped at Moti Mahal to have some food after getting off the bus in Jinja. One day my friend Leticia and I decided to go to the Gaddafi Mosque and we climbed right up to the top of the spire and we learned about the seven hills so that was another amazing moment in this country. We have managed all 272. We managed them all. It was uh, sweaty for me. How were you? You're ve she's very fit. So yeah. She made it, okay. Yeah. Okay, 
So originally Kampala was built on seven hills, but mm. right now they are 23 because it is ever expanding to the nearby hills. Mm. And that's why you're seeing more than seven. I would like to show you the original ones. So this is hill number one where we are, old Kampala hill. Okay. Like I told you, all roads lead to this hill. Okay. So this is the center of all the hills. Yes. Then when you look in this direction, yeah. there is that building painted green and yellow. Yes. And behind it is a Hindu temple with three towers. Okay. So from the Hindu temple, moving up to the Pearl of Africa Hotel. Yes. The quite tall building. The white one, yeah. That is hill number two called Nakasera Hill. Okay. So Nakasera is a Luganda word to mean a basket. Ah. There is a food market behind the yes. Hindu temple. I've been to that mar market. Yeah, so it's the oldest where our grandparents used to go for shopping. Ah. Wherever they could go to the market, they always carried baskets where they could put the things they had bought. So they named it after the baskets, ah. calling it Nakasero Market. I understand. And at the same time, calling the hill Nakasero Hill. I see. Then hill number three is behind the hotel yep. where the two tall masts are. That is called Kololo Hill. We also call it the Bivale Hills because it's where most of the richest people stay. Oh. And most embassies are there. Ah, I see. And then we have the famous taxi station. When you look in the direction of the green and yellow building, yes. on the left where there are so many cars parked. Yes. That is the old taxi park. Okay. So we also call it the organized chaos. Organized chaos. Of Kampala. Yeah, crazy stuff. Yes. I've been in there as well. You've been there? Oh. I, took, I took a taxi from here to uh, to Jinja. If you haven't already, check that video out on my YouTube channel. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I need to stop doing that. Oh, you should. <laughs> then we have a football stadium under reconstruction. Yes. That one is called Nakivuo Stadium. It used to be the national stadium. But now we have a big one called Mandela National Stadium. Okay. When you're moving to the side of Jinja. Ah. So after reconstructing this, it will be for local clubs. Oh, so they're still going to build it and reconstruct it, but no, no clubs play, play there at the moment. No. no. Okay. Then on the right of the stadium yes. is a market with the green roofs. Okay. That is the Owino Market. Ah, yes. Which is the biggest market here in Kampala, majorly a second-hand market, but yeah. there is also food. It's divided into two. One part sells fresh food and the other part sells second hand clothes. Okay. So I guess you're going to feel the experience of chaos. We're going to go to... Since you're going there. Yeah, we're going to feel it. And it is easy and finding the exit will be your experience. <laughs> <laughs> With all of our belongings. <laughs> so hill number four is called Mango Hill. Okay. Where we find the King's Palace. Yes, I've been there. Oh. You've been to everything. I've been in to the. I've been, I've been to the parliament also. The Buganda parliament. Buganda parliament. I went inside. Oh my god. I've also walked down the Royal Mile. The Royal Mile. Yep. Oh, you've really done the whole city. Ah. So that's the King's Palace up on the hill. Yes. The green trees. Okay. This one up here. Yep. Yeah. Then hill number five is Lubaga Hill. Yes. Well, you find the headquarters for the Catholics. Okay. The building up on the hill with the two towers was built in 1914 and finished in 1925. Okay, these ones over there in the distance. Yes. 1925. Yeah. So the cat is that the Catholic building? Yes, that's the Is it big? It's also big. Is it? Yeah. Then hill number six is Namirembe Hill, where we find the St. Paul's Cathedral for the Anglicans. Ah. So that building up on the hill is a church. Yes. It was built in 1915, finished in 1919. 1919. And finally, our hill number seven. That one there is called Makerele Hill, where we find the oldest university. Mm. So that hill with so many trees all over it. You'll never guess. That whole green area is the university. I've been there too. You've been all to the seven hills, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Hey guys, so it's the next day in Jinja. I've stayed the night here in bed and breakfast and I'm waiting for my bus to leave. It's leaving around 6 o'clock. I think it's about 3 p.m. here on the 8th. The next video that you're going to see is a video from visiting the chimpanzees and uh, hope you enjoy it. Hello.
mean a lot to you guys but just staring that chimp in the eyes for like 30 seconds 40 seconds was unbelievable just because they're so like us the next video we're going to watch is a little clip from the Kadodi festival which is a kind of circumcision uh, ceremony um, obviously no circumcision happened at that particular event but we were playing some games and hanging out <laughs> <laughs> Look how nervous he is! How many you got left? Three. Three left. Okay, you can do it. I believe in you. What are you going for? I want the 10,000. You want the 10,000? Okay. Oh. 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 Looking good, guys? Yes. Wow, look at this. Amazing. Wow. Are you guys all getting circumcised today? Is that the? <laughs> Are you going to put it on me as well? Yeah, oh, I... better, well. <laughs> no, I'm not sure. Just on my face. Oh my god. Come on. Yo 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 yo. Are you circumcised already? No. Stay away. <laughs> there were so many more moments I want to show you guys, like the time that I hung out with Lydia Jasmine, a big uh, pop star in Uganda. All right, I'm here with Lydia, the one and only. Hey, I saw it. Yeah. And guess what? Where are the beautiful girls? We're with all the beautiful girls. We're having a good time at EXO Lounge. It's, it's a place to be on a Saturday night. Exactly. No doubt. We're the one and only. Oh, unplanned. 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 I don't know, right? <laughs> All right. Wow. <laughs> Or the time that an old lady tried to beat me with a stick. How are you? America. How are you? UK. How is life? Life's uh, life's okay. Life's okay. Mm. I get to be here, so. I want to give you. Yeah. I want to give you. What do you want? You want to do what? I want to give you a budgie. You want to give me a what? A budgie. A budgie. What's a budgie? A budgie. What's a budgie? Here, here. What? Yeah. Oh, you want to give me? <laughs> Nice to see you. What's a budgie? I don't know what a budgie is. Yeah. Yeah, tell. I don't want. I don't, don't want what? What is the stick you're carrying? I want to beat you. You want to beat me? <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, I think I've got to call the, call the video to an end now because I've got to go and get on my bus to Nairobi. Um, from Ginger, so I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it over the last five months and if you haven't already subscribe to my channel uh, like this video there's gonna be lots more videos from Kenya coming up so thanks